It's early morning, the black tip migration has just arrived, and we're gonna teach Carl the way of the black tip. He hasn't been much of a black tip fan. He's more of a kingfish fan, a wahoo fan, but we're gonna catch some black tips today, and Carl is going to love it. You like that, bro? Do it, yes sir. All right, man, let's do it. Right in front of us, I just saw one jump. Go about three, 300 yards, 300 yards. Slow, 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 we're gonna spook them. Here. Watch, I'm gonna get one right now, watch this, watch this, watch this. They're in that white wash, dude. You can see their fins of the water. Carl, let's keep moving a little more south. Yo, you see the drone? Full day. Head towards the drone, dude. Get big, right, look at them all in the waves. You get to me, that's pretty awesome. Yeah. This is my favorite kind of fishing, guys. I'll tell you what, you guys saw that footage. That shark smoking that lure, jumping, sight fishing them. We had, we tried like four different lures. I just put this one on. You had to keep changing them up, trying to find a different noise that they would respond to. All right, I'll come back when that. The we'll first cast of this lure, field. they hit it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's gonna hate the boat, dude. I think it's a big hammerhead. Nice size one, too. Yeah, it is. There he is. Oh, look, turn up. Oh, watch out, you don't jump right here. <laughs> so sick. It's right here. Not like that at all. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good fish. Ooh. On the popper, look at that, dude. That's sick. Usually I used to be the hooker for this, but ooh, he's trying to bite me. Ooh. Have to cut it, I have to cut it. Cut it. All right, there he goes. Turns around, swims away. The victory, guys, Good catching job. black tip sharks on top water. I'm telling you, it doesn't get any better. It's probably the, I mean, I've done a lot of kinds of fishing, guys, and to watch a shark chase a popper, hit artificial, and your sight fish them, you can see them, it's unbelievable. We just slotted the boat, literally. I'm trying to get close into these black tips here. There's a, there's a swell, and I mean, like Carl said, I, I, I mean, I wish we would have got this on camera, guys. Wade came over three feet over the top of the bow, and I was, I was, I was sitting right here. And then, and, then I, and then I ducked down and went and hit underneath here and it just crushed us. Thank God we got these Pelican cases and these hard hard cases or else our cameras would have been destroyed. We would have had a, an early day. Yeah, that's not good. All right, oh, there's a black tip right there, black tip right there. See him? Well, that one's not gonna hit. That was an impulsive cast, but. Oh, there's one right here, there's one right here. They're everywhere, they're everywhere. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Get in the wheel, Dad. They're everywhere, dude, 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 where's that Bonita at, bro? There you go, yes! Carl, let it sit, let it sit, let it sit, let it sit. They hit it yet, Carl? No. For the morning bite, we got one black tip. We had a few follows. Once that sun gets to a certain level, the bite completely shuts off. They get really skittish. So we're gonna get some live bait right now, come back and pitch some live fish right in front of the black tips. There we go. Nice food runner. Have me? No. Nope. There he goes. Already. Get off the live well. Uno ma. What's that, Carl? What's that? What's that, bro? You talking smack? I don't know what the score was the other day. Like that like is like the perfect bait, guys. Look at this thing. It's like a one. giant sardine. I mean, look at that. Probably gonna have three a piece in each live well. That's it, dude. Hey. We got about half a dozen speedos. We got enough bait now for the black tips. We're gonna go back to the beach and start looking for some sharks. 
They don't hit those speedos, dude. We got, we're dealing with some ridiculously smart fish, okay? Oh, it's a pristine, dude. Woo, big sardine. Look at that thing, speedo. I'm looking for the black tip surfing in the waves right now. We gotta watch these swells. We almost got swamped earlier. We got my speedo right here. The moment I see a shark, I'm gonna cast in front of him. He's gonna destroy it, he's gonna pipe it. Keep going? Yeah, keep going, dude. They're, 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 they're all over the place. They're all headed south, all the moving south. Back, back up, David, back up, back up, back up. Oh, thank God. Another wave. Hey, watch my speedo, bro. What? You never even got wet. All right, we're good now, we're good, we're good. He spooked him, we spooked him. Hold on, there's a bunch in front of us. There's the tarpon right there. We're going to it. What? Get out of here. Dude, that's unbelievable they won't hit this. We tried running the beach, pitching live bait at the black tips. They were not having it. They were super, super spooky. I think the boat was spooking them. So now I got a bait on a float. Oh, we just got a bite. We just got a bite. Oh my gosh, dude. Let him eat it. He, he, dude, he just smoked it, bro. You see, you see the balloon, uh, the bottle? Dude, he just came right up on that speedo, man. Shark on. There he's jumping, he's jumping. There, he, he just bit me off. It's gone. These sharks are so spooky, it's unbelievable. If we're within 100 yards of that bait, they won't eat it. They'll just swim away, they'll swim right past it. So Carl's got a dead bait in the bottom. I got a live speedo, he's getting excited. Hold on, hold on. Oh, he's excited. Oh my gosh, he's excited. He's got one on, here we go. No, he's got it. He's got it? He's, yep, he's got it. He's got it. He said it. He ate it. He ate it. He got him. There you go. Set, 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 set. He's got to be there, dude. Nope. He bit you off? Cut me off. Wow. Wait, where did he bite you at? Oh, dude, look, well, yeah. they're not even biting. Guys, guys, check this out. Look, look at this. They're not even biting the bait. They're just biting the line. What happens is the line's vibrating in the water. They don't like it, and they intentionally bite the line. You can see the teeth marks right there. They go after the line, guys. They want the line more than they want the bait, and I'm not making this up right now. It's not. That's not, that's not some crazy talk. I have it happen all the time on the beach, especially with yellow line. They hate yellow line. I've had days where you get like 15 bite offs in a row, one after another, after another, after another. You have three rods out and they go ding, ding, ding. Each one gets bit off simultaneously. Sharks are being super finicky today. They're not really responding well. We tried live bait, dead bait. We did get the one on the lure and that's a big deal. That's my favorite thing to do. Black tip sharks on top of our lures. Doesn't get any better than that, but it's really frustrating. I mean, I thought for sure they'd be hitting the live bait and especially the dead bait as well, but you know, some of these fish just don't bite and these are, this is one of those days. I mean, I really compare these sharks to like tarpon and snook and any other game fish. They can be really, really tough to catch, but hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you check out Slob City Charters, links in the description, and we'll see you next time. Black Tip H Fishing is brought to you by Frog Tongs, designed for you, created for the outdoors and Sudacore Nutrition.